Hey guys, welcome back to another episode. My name is Mobby, back with Mortuaria, the Epic Mod Pack Season 8, the Necromancer class, uh, combining both magic and summoning into one, live streaming right here at twitch.tv slash mobby versus games live very frequently, almost every single day, so please come on by, we'd love to see you here, even if we're not playing Terraria, come on, come on, just come on by, don't be one of those people, I'm only here for Terraria, come on, come on guys, come on, let's go, so uh, let's give some shoutouts to some people who are here today. Sarah's here, Ricky's here, Cheese is here, Melon's here, Old Fan's here, Melon's here, Britney's here. A lot of people, so thank you for stopping by. Blitzfire Gamer with the Prime Sub. Special shout out to you. This, this this episode is dedicated to you, Blitzfire. Thanks for subbing with Twitch Prime. I appreciate it, man. Welcome. Welcome to the stream. Yeah, buddy. Alright, so what are we going to do today? Well, I'm going to craft some new eyes. We did a lot of off-screen farming. And check this out, dude. We have so many new items. A lot of it seems to be from the Tremor mod. You can see here we got Doomstones and stuff. We'll have to take a look at this later. But for now, I, I want to, um, you know, I did farm some Star Quartz. Which we're going to use to upgrade. Upgrade our Stardust set. Um, see the glasses here? It's um, 19. This is 12. The leggings are 20. So it's a... It's a big upgrade in defense, and I really hope it's a big upgrade in damage as well. So here we go. So this is going to be just straight out modded stuff. Blitz! <laughs> uh, try not to uh, spam the spa spam this capsule. Alright. We're also going to get rid of one of these items so I can use the Stardust Emblem. Minion damage by 17 and max minions by 2. It's really good. I'll probably get rid of this. As much as, you know, it, it took forever to make this, it's not, actually, actually, it's not that, actually, no, it's okay. If anything, we can get rid of the uh, waifu to bottle, which I was using, and we'll put that on instead. So let's go ahead and upgrade some items today. So I'm going to go ahead and start with the Stardust Emblem here. I'm um, going to, first of all, I need to uh, check it out here. All right, 20% invulnerability. Let's go ahead and reform it. I made a crap ton of essence of favorable fates. So here we go. Uh, we'll keep going until we hear the, the click for legendary and or primal. That's a primal. That's pretty good. Reduces potion cooldown by 6 and vulnerability by 20. Now next thing we need to do is of course um, make it warding because why not. Gotta get all the uh, defense that we can, I guess. Let's see here. Violet, hard, quick, hasty, menacing. Look at that. It doesn't even take that much money. That's really good. Yeah, buddy. So that's really, really awesome. So we got minion by two. This is uh, this one doesn't really increase our, our summons, but it does increase... A lot of magic abilities here. It's really good. So it's just a great item in general. Reggie, what is up, homie? Thanks for being here. Actually, I'll fix this one up too. Whoa, 18% uh, more invulnerability. We can do better than that. We can do better. Negative mana cost, dude. I have 200. We can do better. Come on. Oh. Come on. Oh, it's using up a lot. It's using up a lot of favorable fates, man. That's a primal. Sup, Eric? Um, that's oh, that's so good. Plus two health regeneration. The max mana is whatever, but the regeneration is fine. So look at that. We have lots of primal and legendaries. Um, this one's already plus two health. It's okay. So yeah, we were great. It's time for the big thing: upgrading our Stardust set. So, like, what do we need to do for that? So look at this enchantment. Okay, so we need an Aegis contraption. An Aegis Contraption. Uh-oh. I hope I can make this. E I Aegis Contraption. Um, 15 Luminite and 10 Fallen and an Ancient Manipulator. Yeah, that's pretty easy. I'm going to watch this later on the YouTubes. Yeah, you better. You better Blitzfire. Better see your comments in the um, description and in the comment section since it's dedicated to you and whatnot. Thanks, buddy. Uh, where's my Luminite bar? Did I put him into one of these chests? I feel like I did. There they are. So 10, 15 um, over and 10 of these. Let's grab 10, 2, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Got a, oh, 
Look at that slime over there. Let's just love how... Uh, oh, it's by the way, it's Halloween when I'm recording this, guys. It's October 31st. So it feels good, man. Alright, let's go ahead over here. Here's our Aegis contraption. Used for processing cal calcum, palestite, mantillium, veritite, and starlight ore. We're getting smacked around by a bunch of enemies. The blighted matter. Oh my god. Oh my god. Really? You see how much like abuse that enemy took? Oh my god. Just leave me alone so I can craft this item. Please? Oh, yeah, Tramium. Uh, the Tremor Mon. Tramium Mon. Not annoying at all. Not annoying at all. Definitely a fun item. A fun, fun thing. I was going to put this down right here. Boom. Okay, so here we go. We're going to upgrade them. Uh, and then we are definitely going to reforge them. So this is the full set here. Looks like none of these got legendary or something like that. We must have gotten extremely, extremely lucky for all of my Stardust ones to become legendary when I first crafted them. So let's start with this. Um, oh my god, please. The freaking rolls are so bad. We have 200, so we'll go for it. Oh, come on. There you go. Um, damage taken cannot exceed 277. That's fine with me. That's the best one on there. That's a primal max health movement speed. Mining speed's whatever anymore, but the 10% movement speed is really good. So I locked it. Unlock it. Uh, damage. Oh, yeah, this is fine. You know, uh, none of these are health regens, but it's pretty good. They all do different stuff. Damage exceeds the best. Movement speed's the best here, and here the damage taken under 10 is fine. Okay, so let's check out our defense. Using our magic set, uh, damage is, our defense is 92, jumps up to 110. It's pretty good. Now, this set here, it's mostly for minion damage, so GG magic. So, all right now our magic is uh, 228. It, it's going to go down to 183, which is pretty bad. But, our ma while wearing the magic armor, our damage is 100 summon. Oh, it's going to go up by a lot. Here we go. Ooh, 125. It's pretty good. Now, it's time to look at the uh, the set bonus. Set bonus, extra minions and a Stardust Dragon at your disposal. So, really? How many, how many minions can we actually have now? Like, this is insane. This is, in any mod pack, this is the most ever amount of minions that I'm able to summon and I don't need to keep swapping out the thing oh my god dude so look at this it's one two three four five six and then I it's just extra minions for the set bonus so I'm gonna assume two more right so it's one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen so at least seventeen minimum seventeen that we know of right that's insane imagine if I took out the sigil and the creator for even more summons but 17 seems fine let's see how big this dragon gets it's awesome it's gonna be amazing oh my god he just keeps growing look he keeps growing 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 i think he's still going i think it's still going i can't tell i really can't tell but I, it might be done it's a big ass dragon guys it's a big ass dragon it's done that's the oh a thousand each Did you see that like a thousand damage when it ran through there it's pretty strong man it's pretty freaking strong oh baby Woo! oh look at some dark mass that's great now where's my equipment here let's go ahead and drop this thing in here so the starters quartz i don't think we need this anymore right the only thing i can make out of it oh a shooting star Oh, yeah, we should try this, huh? So this is a 256 summon damage. A shooting star to fight for you. This is 125, but remember, it's just 1,000 per per hit. But let's try out this new star thing. Like, I really want to just test out new weapons today and stuff. Uh, so we'll try that right now. Also, I want to make the star rod, which is going to require... Uh, we have everything. Okay, so we're shooting star staff and a star rod. Oh, this is... Oh, it's one of these things. Like, the one that follows your thing around. It's not the worst, but I hate it. I really don't like these things. It's a material. It turns into nothing, just a decorative thing. 
So it's it's going away. All right, let's try this out, huh? Oh, a thousand each. Like I don't see how these stars can like nothing can beat the Stardust Dragons, man. Well, let's go and check out um, the shooting stars. I can get like 17 of these, but remember, damage is limited. Things, you know, it, <laughs> it's like it's pretty good. But unless we get something that rivals the Stardust, I don't. I don't think we'll use this. Hmm. Any damage here or what? Something needs to come out. Oh, now, now the enemies aren't showing up. Now they don't want it. Hmm. I could probably get a lot more of these actually. Yeah. yeah I don't think I'll use these. Glad I made it. But it's okay. I guess right, right, right now we're gonna use the Stardust Dragon. And hopefully, um, swap out my magic later. Goodbye. No bueno. So anything else with this? No, I think that's it. I'll probably get rid of this now. So goodbye, Star Quartz. You've been really nice, but there you go. All right, so we're going to start preparing for the upcoming boss fights. And um, to do that, we're going to have to do Calamity bosses and stuff. So we're going to have to go to the Hollow. And farm a little bit on the uh, the over the overworld, and get some profane item stuff. We're super strong, so let's go over here, and you know hopefully I can get some profane stuff in the desert. Let's go. So the Star Dragon is it's just chewing everything up. It's amazing. Okay, let's go. I have so much room now since I don't have to freaking. This is gonna go away. That's gonna go away. You have a lot of extra room. All right. So remember, we've got um. The Lunar Flame on its own, which is pretty good. And then we got these uh, Ancient Flames, but we have two of them, so two at once. Okay. So the Profane stuff should be around here, and I hope so. Let's see here. We might have to increase the rate. And enemies freaking paw show up. Why do I even use EF anymore? I don't need to use EF, right? There's another Ancient Rat. Yeah, I'm just destroying everything, dude. It's so good. Trilamium core. I got a Trilamium core. Ew. Yeah, I need to change one of the overworlds. I think we're going to get rid of this biome and make it profane. No, the Crystal Digger. Oh, you guys didn't see that. The Crystal Digger. There it goes. It's like a... It's from the Trilamium boss or something. Anyway, that thing shows up a lot. You have to farm a lot of it so you can make a certain weapon or item. I think it was an armor, though. I'll have to kill it really quick and show you guys. Well, as you can see there, it has its own HP bar, which is really annoying. Doo doo. All right, and it shows up a lot, which I kind of hate. It's a, it's a very obnoxious boss. I I I would say it's just a boss, you know. It's really annoying. Look at it. Look at him go. Ugh. Three hundred thousand health. He keeps moving around. Freaking uninvited. Just shows up there. He killed my dryad. We have to wait to kill it. I'm not getting any of the profane stuff. Maybe it's because it's a desert, but I do remember fighting it a lot last season. Perhaps I need to uh, fix up a hollow biome somewhere else that's not desert. I'm just trying to finish this crystal digger first. He should be dead in a couple seconds if he doesn't run away first. All right, come on, buddy. Is he dead yet? Crystal digger. He's not showing up. It's, oh, I got I got 15 platinum from something. There you go. It even has like um, you know, a thing here. So we picked up um, a Crystallion, fires arrows to transform nebula arrows. All right, cool. Well, goodbye. And then the Nebular Crystal Crystal Tite, which is oh Crystallite, which is really important. Like I said, you can make a, a nice set here. The set's okay. You know, it's pretty good magic. Actually, it gives us some pretty good minions as well. But here's the thing, like 31 for this one, 26 for that one, 28 for this one. It just takes so much, and, and it, the Crystal Digger just dropped three on its own. So it'll take forever. I can also make the Crystallized Rose, and of course, you need it for a boss item. So the Mites are easy. Technolite, I'm not sure. You know, Ultimate Technology Core, we might have that already. Yeah, I think we have these. The Dark Steel, really, really easy to make. So the only thing we're missing, wait, what do I, oh, look at that, the Emperor Crown, the Dark Emperor, and the Doomstone. 
God dang, so many, so many like new end game bosses now. So we're not even. I did say we were like semi close to finishing this the season. It's kind of true, but enemies just won't stop popping up. So I'm gonna finish off this crystal digger, and then we're gonna make another um, hollow biome, so I can get so I can fight some profane stuff. But this is an extremely obnoxious and annoying boss right here. Okay. Ugh, I don't even have to do anything. Just gotta let my, uh, my minions do the work. Stardust. I forgot how the Stardust Dragon works. If you you can double tap it, he goes in an area, but I, I don't remember what exactly he does. He either attacks or protects you. One of those things. I, get, I wish this guy would go away. Please. Look at how big my dragon! This is the largest I've ever had my dragon. It's maze balls. I'm sure it won't be the last time he'll be this large. Now I'm saying. Pew pew. The traveling merchant has departed. He was here. Didn't even know. Did not even know. All right. So I gotta get a lots of hollow. I gotta get a contaminator. We gotta make some uh, hollow solution. Let's see. Nice, nice, nice. All right. Let's go over there. Let's get home. Put everything away. The dried has arrived. Oh, thank God. Thank God. All right, put all this away. Light mummy banner. Hmm. All right, put this away. Cooked fish. What was I gonna do? Ah, it's a right contaminator. Because I want to fix up one of these areas. I think I'll do it right here, like on this left side. I kind of want to keep this neutral, which it has been the whole season. But this one, like, I can I can fit it in here, and then we can. I don't know. Make some sort of secondary arena. We're farming that there. Uh, no. You should, there you are. Isabella. Uh, let's see. You don't have hollow solution, right? You have the spirit and the green solution. Destroys the spirit. Spreads the spirit. Okay, so we'll get a contaminator. It's a material. Clin Clintamistation. Awesome. I think we already made that. Um, solution. Solution. So how do I craft one? Use purity, crimson, hollow. It's just a hundred blue droplets. And blue droplets is just a blue solution. All right, the easiest thing to do is to make a house in hollow, move her in there. That'll be the best thing. So I think it's okay if I make a small house here in the desert. That might be good. Let's go do that really quick. I hate having to make quick houses right off the bat, but it's fine. All right, let's do this. We gotta spread that hollow. Do 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 pew pew pew. GG the raid boys. Oh my god, here's the crystal digger again. See what I mean? I'm not even like trying to fight it. And here's the thing: once we actually spend the time to farm the items we need, it's like, what's the use now? He's just gonna sit there and be super annoying. <sighs> one of the mods, man. One of the mods. I don't really like it. I think this is an okay place to put the house, right? Na, na, na. Should be good enough. One, two, three. Yee! Dude Splicer! Come on. Okay. There we go. One, two, three, four, fresh X. I love the music. Ah. Something hurt me. I don't know what it was. Okay. Starshine workbench because I can. Uh, let's see. Workbench. Need a chair now. There's a cup. There's a Starshine chair. Why the hell not? Enjoy yourself. You get all the cool starshine stuff. Here's a mirror, Latisse walls. That's pretty sick. Oh my god, come on. She's only gonna live here for a second. And I hope it's in the correct spot. It better be in a good spot. All right, and we need some light. So let's go ahead and grab. Where's her face at? Where is your face? Where'd she go? Oh, she's here, there it is. Okay, put it here. Now that she's there. As long as she, she is set there, I think we're good. I teleported and now she's there. I went to clean dishes, what'd you miss? Oh, well, you know. Terraria. You didn't miss much. You missed everything. You missed the biggest things in this game. Feels, got, feels good, man. You guys know that Brittany bought Terraria? And she got mad because she couldn't figure out what to do. But, but the game does have a lack of direction, for the most part. Alright. You have a... Uh, spreads the hollow, here we are. Spreads the hollow. That's all we needed. <laughs> uh, all right. So we're gonna spread this thing right here. We're gonna make a nice hollow biome, like a contaminator. Okay, here we go. A lot of uh, NPCs just died. So 
There we go. We're gonna spread the hollow here. There's a lot of spirit there. We're actually gonna get some stuff that destroys the spirit. Kinda wanna half and half it. Yeah, uh, we gotta move her back over here. The crystal digger is destroying all my What a really, really annoying enemy. Extremely annoying. Where is he at? Oh my god, he's so annoying. Oh, please. Game didn't give me tutorial. Oh, oh bad game. Feels good, man. Feels good. This crystal digger is really annoying. Alright, what we're gonna do is we're gonna get rid of him. We're gonna farm the hollow for a bit and then we'll see what we get. So, if you're watching on YouTube, gonna end here. Twitch went going nowhere. If you guys enjoyed, leave a like. It helps so much if you haven't already. Subscribe for daily videos. We are very strong now. Very happy with what we got. And spread the hollow. See what's going on. Thanks for being here. And I'll see you guys next time.